So this one, give you an example, this is a 1.8 million dollar box. Holy shit. So this is the 59.90 Protect Philippe, all with original Diamond Baguettes. Not your typical hedge fund guy is gonna, is gonna be grabbing yeah. this one. You know, definitely your celebrities, rappers. Two million dollars. So this is more your, your Jamie Dimon, your Saudi Sheikh, LeBron James type individuals were in this. Exactly. I, I DM Nicki Minaj every week about this watch. I forgot, I forgot to answer it, so. We are over here at and we're going to be looking at some watches with the luxury watch guy on Twitter. One inside the booth, man. Let me make sure that's his. One stand in the booth, yeah. No, 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 you, you, you. So this is the same watch without the diamonds. It's the 5990 uh, 1A. This one right now, today, would probably be around $150,000. Okay. This probably was a third of that before COVID. Yeah. And then the COVID peak is probably closer to $250,000. Yeah. So, so talk to us a little bit about the kind of watch market right now. So the, the scary thing is the market's exactly in tune with like, um, with crypto and stock. Mm -hmm. Minus the last few months, because in this last stock bump, watches not changed, which kind of scares me a little bit. Since COVID, COVID highs are probably down 50%. Wow. Most models are, one and a half times retail, I would say. Yeah, yeah. So for an investment banker, you know, from the analyst to associate VP, director, MD level, when they're coming in with their bonus, what type of watches are they getting? So when they're coming in, depending on how much they want to spend, I don't have it here, but they're usually buying an Oster Perpetual or Sub-Aaron. Okay. They're usually the basic starter watch. Mm -hmm. uh, after that, or maybe if they want to go a little fancier, the first one, thank you, perfect, uh, maybe a Batman. Mm -hmm. Right. Batman, Pepsi's are common, and okay. then I would say call it second tier tied with that with the GMTs or the or the Datejust. Right, mm -hmm. two tones. People love that. So call your first tier Oyster Perpetual or Submariner. Then we're talking GMTs or two tone Datejust, mm -hmm. and then when, the next upgrade I would say is probably the Daytonas. Right. So people love the black Daytona. The pen is obviously very popular. And then once you already establish a few watches, then you really start getting to like the, the six figure range with some pieces. So. These are like some of my favorite. I love the I love the precious metal Daytonas. And I can vouch for this because many of the partners of Centerview would wear the Daytonas. So this is definitely the correct progression that we have going on. So this is one of my favorite watches. Beautiful. This is the platinum face diamond dial Rolex Daytona uh, from Platinum. So I would say when you're leveling up to the next six foot, mm -hmm. six foot, this is the first one you want to really go. Okay. Like, this is like the dream watch for a lot of people. That's mm -hmm. you know. Today it's 120k. It's yeah. pretty, pretty obtainable. Yeah. These two just got discontinued. These were 90k uh, a few months ago. As soon as they got discontinued, they doubled overnight. And I luckily bought a few right before. Uh, but these are some of my favorites. These, these Daytona wise is probably some of the best you can find. Beautiful. This is what we call a factory sealed watch. When the Petit Philippe is factory sealed, never opened in the plastic, obviously it'll work a lot more. This is the 5270R white dial. This is what I call a straight up auction piece. Today, this watch, probably 180000 But extremely rare, discontinued, uh, and, and really gorgeous. I wish I could take out a posse for you guys, but um, please do not have a look. <laughs> oh, look at this, 180 k an auction piece. This is the kind of thing you'll see like in Chrissy's. Uh, yeah, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. So this is my favorite one. Not the most expensive is the diamond one, okay. but this is really like special. So this is the 5372P. Oh my. Platinum blue dial, extremely rare. Uh, this is really one of the best protects on a strap you, you can find today. I would say a fair market price, 600000 for this watch. Wow. Yeah, this one is like... Beautiful. Uh, and how many, do you know how many of these exist, or...? They, they, don't, they don't say. They don't say. How, how much is it? 600 k yeah, Each one of these are not 200 k wow. right now yeah. in today's market. This is the 5270p, like crazy collector's piece. So if you're talking about leather band Patex, this is like the goat for a lot of people. How do you run a business like that where you're just constantly ready to buy, like put so much to work? Like you're just, are you just like looking at your inventory levels? Like how do you? To even have some sort of back to that, like 10 million liquid. Yeah. yeah, yeah. The problem is the market fluctuates like crazy. Yeah. Like a buy these for 40, tomorrow they'll be 30. Yeah, yeah. So like we're taking losses half the time this year, but also a few million bucks. But like you're probably made like 10, you know, so like it's always is you, you can't be afraid to take a loss mm -hmm. and you can't be afraid to dump and right. yeah because you, you make money when you have when you're when you're when you're liquid you have cash yeah. Yeah. you know if i'm sitting on inventory and just waiting for it to go down and go down i'm just getting mm -hmm. rocked but okay i'll take 50k loss sell yeah. it i'll just add money now i'm back in the game i can start buying and selling again yeah. so when people want to get their first patek philippe models you're ready for that big jump mm -hmm. this is the 5712. this is one of my favorite watches this i have one i have personally couldn't get on this way so stainless steel and how much is this? Brand new today, 135. 
you could find them used as little as low as one time military. Yeah, no. the Tiffany's edition. Can you give your hands on any of those? Yeah, we had a bunch. Uh, yeah. This one also, like, basically just the type of Tiffany snap on it makes it all these double. Mm -hmm. So you can see right here. Where is it? Right there on the bottom. Tiffany and Cole. Oh, yeah. This is the roll timer. This one's discontinued platinum, and the final protector 65K is not not that common. Yeah. So yeah. I, when people want to get into protects with the straps, I say go with this one. Okay. So this is the uh, 5164 Aquanaut Rose Gold. Uh, and then, you know, like Nautilus, when someone's going, it's either that or this, when you're getting the protector. Yeah, 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 so yeah, yeah. You know, people love it in steel, people love it in the gold. This is really cool. Okay. Nobody has this. Certain watches, you can't, it's hard to even find a picture online. Yeah, you know? yeah. So this is the Vacheron Masset, the Vacheron Constantine. Um, they made three mass sets. Okay. Three kinds of mass sets. Not only three were produced, but maybe 20 were produced. I don't want to say the exact number, don't, don't, don't come me on the camera. Mm -hmm. So this is one of the three sets. It's very hard to have the entire set. Wow. Awesome. Yeah. Look at the, look at the detail on that. So uh, what, what would the uh, appraisal be of this? How quickly can you do an appraisal? This, I, got, I got the papers at home and the card. This today, I would offer you fifteen thousand for this watch. Okay. Okay. Would you get it for? More than that, I'll, I'll, I'll <laughs> say that. I'll say that. <laughs> Did you buy it recently? Uh, I bought it a year and a half ago. It's crypto money. Yeah, crypto money. Yeah. 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 Fake money. Yeah. yeah. Why not? The crypto uh, guys are the best customers in the world. I can't. Like, big money has no value to them. It's like everything. Yeah. You know, just like. Have they uh, fallen off a cliff? And they, they, they have serious effect on the market. Yeah. I, I, I thought I thought it wouldn't be like a real thing when crypto went down the first time. Yeah. Oh my god, AP is one out fifty percent. This is the Baricelli discontinued. I love this watch, man. Pretty hard to find these. Massive. Look at that. Maybe I see one or two on the market every year. This is this is heavy. Yeah, this is a heavy it's a big watch. watch. That today, since discontinued, it actually didn't get hit like the other ones. That's probably seventy-five K right now. Yeah. It's thick. It's wow. a girthy watch. It's a big watch. People are obsessed with the offshores. Love that forty-four and then. This is a crazy watch, man. Your top, your top crypto guys buying this one. This oh, is like, yeah, yeah, This is yeah, what yeah. me about. Yeah, this is my Annie with a, a rented Lambo. Oh, oh, my God. You took the words out enough. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Wow. Hilarious. That today is like 250. Yeah. Crypto money. Oh, Thank you. oh look at that. It was, this is the rose gold uh, blue. What's the reference on this one? Beautiful. What's the reference on this one? No, this is a little professional. What's the code for? 300? Yeah. Amazing. That's beautiful. What's the security like you got in here? It's got to be wild. Yeah. I've only seen a few arm robberies in this whole area because you got to be really slick to pull that off. Mm. But yeah, it's, uh, yeah. It's but then there's, you got the big safes I see and, you know. You know at, any, at any moment, you can have 20, 30 million just people carrying them. That's almost one block. Yeah, 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 yeah. If you want to have all the merchandise in all these buildings, it's priceless, you know. Yeah. 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 Billions and millions of dollars. It's crazy. Yeah. Incredible. And it's all like armored car stuff to like ship them and stuff. Yeah. 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 Either, um, when it's really big, I'll, I'll maybe I'll fly out personally with one of the partners. Uh, a lot of times we're flying overseas. And, yeah. You know, it's, it's part of the game also. If you're bringing like a billionaire guy, like a half million dollar watch, they want to see you also. They want to yeah. you know, put that extra effort in there. Mm -hmm. But otherwise, I'm carrier. That's usually what I'm doing. It. I'm doing a lot of FedEx. Okay. Okay. Well, well, like, the FedEx boxes here, you'll see them. There's a lot more watching stuff. It's like, it's like, <laughs> Wild. The FedEx here is like four dollars. You gotta see. You gotta get a bus like three things to get in there. Yeah, it's crazy. You know, arm, arm guards. You know. Oh my god. So, so it's kind of like this to me. What's uh, what's one of the the craziest stories you can tell us? On camera? Uh, I can play really crazy on camera. Yeah, <laughs> let's do let's do off camera for. You gotta sell this guy a watch. He, he's got a Timex, you know. He's gotta do better than that. You should sell him something. He needs some style. Style. Time buy a Rolex. Right. Rolex. Yeah. Spend right. some money, my friend. Yeah. The whole life is profit. You never lose. You only whole, make less. Whole life, is, whole life is profit. Never lose. Exactly. <laughs>